I have a lot of goats because they're my favorite. Here we go. Let's go. Come on. Hi, I'm Sue Weaver, and I'm the crazy goat lady, and I love goats. Jenzia, Curzon, Emily, Kira, come on, Drex. John and I both are Star Trek fans, and so over the years, a lot of our animals have had Star Trek names. There's nothing else quite like a goat. They're very mischievous animals, and they're fun to have around. <laughs> that was a sheep. <laughs> the sheep disagrees. <laughs> but they're very intelligent, and they're very affectionate. They're just like having a dog or a cat. Oh, Marta. Well, I like to blog, and, and he was raised in the house. He was a bottle baby. And he watched me, and he learned to blog. Two weeks ago, he wrote about dung beetles because he saw a dung beetle out in this field. For Monday, he's going to write about this. <laughs> in we go. Come on. Well, this is my little writing getaway. It's, it's made out of a storage building. I started writing in 1968, and I've never stopped. My most recent goat book is called The Backyard Goat, and it, it talks about how you can keep just a few goats in a very small area. Once upon a time, there were three billy goats who lived. This is what puts food on your table, and that's kind of what my aim is, is just to give them a good life. You guys are too so nervous. Get over it, Bon If I won $5,000, I wouldn't have to worry about where the animal food is coming from and I could take in more. I, th we are really maxed out now. It would be a real blessing <laughs> for the animals.